Said that. Welcome back to Ubage. So, um, today we're going to be going over how I broke a desk. And, um, yeah, so basically, I was walking over to Jack, and um, I was inside of a class. Yeah, um, basically, Jack was sitting somewhere. I walked over to him. And the back part of the desk just kind of snapped off whenever you I put my hand over in it. No, you I did not run over. I did your not. Hand onto the chair <laughs> and broke it. I did not run. You I walked. I waltzed. Waltz? I waltzed over to the desk. And um, basically, the back of the whole chair just kind of broke off. Um, and then... I wouldn't say just broke off. It flew off. <laughs> yeah, it flew off. I got a scrape on my arm. And then... Um, Mr. Merriam, our executive, he um, picked up the desk and moved it in front of the whiteboard. Then Jonah sat there. Then Jonah sat there. And then Mr. Webster started using that as an area to put his um, his his coffee pods. And then um, eventually the school admin just took the desk away and didn't ask any questions. Never asked if anyone got hurt. Never asked who broke it. I thought I was going to be expelled. I thought that we were going to have to pay for it. Then, um, t uh, like two days ago, I, um, I was, so it was this, there was this, like, stalker guy who was looking at on one of the kids inside of, um, inside of the room. No. It was, like, an old man. And basically, I went to go close the blinds inside the library, and then they just kind of snapped off. Yeah, and then um, I told the school admin... And then he, he he didn't sound angry, but then he walked in. His ears looked like he was angry because they started turning red. Uh, give some of that. <laughs> yeah. Um, basically, so now the blinds inside the library are broken. The school's missing missing a desk. You've already broken the blinds. Um, well, I broke the back of it whenever I was walking up to Jack, and, um, Miss, Miss, he never, he never asked. The whole top part of the back. Huh? What'd you say? Uh, Mr. Webster's. Mr. Merriam. Um, basically, school never asked any questions. He said that they never asked him questions. So... Yeah. Okay, yeah, this is all happening. Okay, okay uh, now, Nicholas had some interesting things to talk about with our uh, Google Meet call that we had about something that we had inside of, you know, history. one of our history things. Yeah. Oxford is concerning. Yeah. Yeah. So um, we had to do this history project, and our teacher said that this is... Super easy. And it's an easy project. This is an easy project. Three weeks later, we're still doing it. <laughs> yeah. And um, basically, she assigned all of the people with ADHD to one group. Yeah. Kind of the worst idea ever. And then we tried to point out the grading scale problem because she wanted us to do like... You did that and started riding a bounty. Well, yeah. They wanted us to do like a... riding a donkey? What? What? Yeah. <laughs> but basically, she wanted us to do like a 20-page project within one week. But then it ended up being two weeks. It didn't quite work out. And then some people started doing it on three weeks. So basically, yeah. Two, she gave up on yeah, so we had to work on it while I was at home and Nicholas was at his house. So we did it through Google Meet. And somebody named Jack doesn't know how to use Google Meet. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay? It wasn't working. Yeah, yeah no, but it was your... Mm -hmm, yeah, yeah, okay. And then basically... You wasted most of your time there trying to get... Uh, no, Jeff, I was working while I was talking to you. His printer is also concerning. Oh, yeah. yeah. My, my printer was gagging whenever... <laughs> <laughs> what? His printer was gagging, Jack. Yeah. Get so, it together. Um, I went to go print something, and then my printer started making weird gagging noises, and uh, yeah. that was weird. <laughs> so then um, we got the history project done, and um, Miss Gr I mean, our history teacher just slowly started to give up on us, and then she started working on other groups. Mm -hmm. Then somehow we finished before one of the other groups, and if we were the group that was the most behind. Yeah, that, that was also concerning. Yeah, but I think it was because the other group had the one person that they had, all the stuff was sick that week for a migraine. Yeah. Mikey. <laughs> oh, oh God. Finally, he's going to come over here and talk. It's your yeah, segment yeah, anyways. Yeah. Come here and talk. That's okay. against community guidelines. Yeah, okay. <laughs> well, I guess we're going to have to talk for him. So, we went outside. Man, there was another thing. There was another thing. Uh, uh, well, it, 
Yeah. Oh yeah. Um, my mom basically, uh, basically. So my mom works at, works for a uh, daycare during Wednesdays, and um, Nick, let's just describe what you heard. It sounded like his house was burning down, and they were screaming for help. <laughs> Yeah, and then um, the, the, my mom kept bang, my mom kept banging on the wall, and it was very, it was very creepy. Yeah, and then eventually she just walked in and she put a plate of food on my desk, um, and then she just ran away and left. And I got a doorbell notification: someone is at your front door. And then my sister was still at home, so. Basically, you're gonna do number three. Part of the news from Mikey. We have Mr. Hall's shoe randomly disappearing and appearing around the school. First, it was in the soccer field, and now it was in the men's locker room. Who knows where it's gonna be next? We'll find out next time on. I need to that out, but you know. No. Okay, so. Basically, now we have another thing that happened. So basically, um, when did you do during that lunch like that? of uh, last, year, last, oh, year, last year, oh, yeah, la last year, was it this year? This I don't know. Pizza? Basically, I was laughing and I accidentally snorted a Frito. Oh, yeah, I remember that. That was last year. Oh, yeah, that, that was last year. It was. So I was laughing so hard and then I accidentally almost <laughs> breathed, and then yeah. I breathed in and I had a Frito in my mouth. Yeah. And I actually snorted it and it went up my nose and down my nose, yeah. <laughs> and my nose was like burning for the rest of the yeah. day. Yeah, he was complaining yeah. for a week. And I felt like that. I was gonna puke, and uh, yeah. yeah. Do not snort Fritos, kids. Um, <laughs> and then you put Fritos in your nose. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so that would be, it was very painful. It can probably get even worse. No, no, you can complain for like a month, not a week. Yeah, I was in pain for a very long time. <laughs> so basically, that that was what led to my traumatic life experiences. You've already had that. <laughs> well, that's why I'm in psych therapy now. You've already been in. Yeah. Like, so yeah, um. Yeah. And then my therapist recommended that I go to a higher ranking therapist. <laughs> Oh. Because she also gave up on him. Yeah, and then whenever I was inside my therapy call last Saturday, my sister just kept randomly coming up to my door and making random comments. It was really That's creepy. And, uh, yeah. Um, so basically, that's... A work in progress? A work in progress. And that's why they suspended my Google Pay account also, I believe. Please, Google, unsuspend my Google Pay account. I need it. Wow. Um, That's the last thing you need. Well, you need your Google Pay account in order to use your Google Play account. For Google Play if, for Play? Yeah. If you are doing any sort of transactions on Google Play, at least. So, And then, um, basically, my AC broke during the summer of last year. And um, my house's temperature was like 86 degrees. So my dad still doesn't use the AC now, but... Yeah, that concludes this episode. Bye.